Hey everyone, um, my name is Christian, and this is a brief demonstration of how hooding will be going this, this year at MCG. So administration is gracious enough to allow us to, put, to pick our faculty hooders this year, which is sweet and ensures that you're gonna share a special moment with a faculty member that really impacted your medical career, and hopefully it'll be a reciprocal enjoyment for the faculty hooder as well. Um, so since this has some logistical uh, checks and balances, I figured that a video that demonstrates this would be easier to make sure that uh, our system is communicated as effectively as possible. So um, I'll start with the Bell Auditorium. So uh, family will be sitting around here, family and friends, and we'll be up here. So we'll be sitting down here, faculty and hooders will be right in this section right here. So I'll zoom in right there and that's where this will mainly take place. So here's a rough draft of the stage party. So we have Dean Hess, Dr. Miller, Brooks Keel, et cetera, all on the front row right here with the hooders in the rows behind them as usual in the past. So in order to avoid having 21 hooders standing single file on the front stage and being congested, we split it into three waves. So we split the Augusta hooders into two waves, wave one and wave two, nine each, followed by the Athens campus, which is wave three. And I'll explain how this is going to go accordingly. So this year, our students pick their hooder. So uh, they'll be sitting in their seats. But what we notice, if we have a normal alphabetical seating chart as we do in the past, once students line up, we have the risk of one student sitting next to another student that picked the exact same hooder. And since, as you know, uh, typically students go on the stage together. So having somebody sitting next to somebody who has their same hooder preference, you risk the uh, chance of two students having a traffic jam on stage when they have the same hooder. Kaboom. So in order to make this hooder selection work, we had to make sure that we had a seating chart that ensured that a student sat next to a student with a different hooder, which is exactly what we did. So we staggered each student's hooder selection to ensure that they were always sitting next to somebody with a different hooder. So you never had the risk of congestion or a traffic jam on stage, which is exactly what happens. So now that we have a seating chart that ensures that a traffic jam won't happen, I'll show you exactly how um, hooding will go this year. So what we'll do is we'll have X's on the stage that have your name on it. So you'll know exactly where to stand and you'll have wave one, wave two, and wave three. So what will happen is wave one will come down, they'll stand on their X, followed by the students. Now we're actually doing three at a time this year to ensure we go faster, and the staggering ensures that no three at a time will have the same hooder as well. So we're good to go. So three at a time, students will go on stage, they'll get hooded by their hooder, and then they'll sit right back down. And then we'll do this until all the wave one students get hooded, and then wave one will sit right back down followed by wave two doing the exact same thing, coming up here, hooding as we go along, and then we get to wave three, which is Athens campus. And that's about it. So this is essentially what it'll look like. So we'll have wave one coming down, and all the students who select hooders within wave one will get hooded. And then as you make your way along this, this row, you'll have wave two. So wave one will sit down, wave two hooders will come out. And you guys will all get a list of the hooding arrangements, so you'll know exactly when it's time for wave two, exactly when it's time for wave three. So, um, and the, these these uh, hooder orders will be passed out to everybody. So everybody will know exactly what where you are in the list, uh, who you'll be hooding, and when it is time for wave two to come up. So as you wake, make your way from wave one to wave two and wave three, everybody everybody will be hooded and everybody will be hooded and share that special moment with a faculty member that really impacted their medical career. Um, and that's about it. Um, please let me know if you have any questions at all. Hopefully this makes sense. And uh, I really think that uh, we'll be able to make this happen. Um, okay, let me know if you have any questions.